Get into it, get a home mural, and then we're, come on, I want you to talk to the camera no, so you can hear. Tell, tell them who it is. Oh, it's tell, what, what you're, Are you going? Yes. Push. Recording. This is a picture of Admiral Nalima. Admiral Nalima. He was shot 45 times by the police at the 43rd precinct. Was he shot 45 times? Yes, keep 45 it level. Times. It's better to keep it level because that's going to make it horizontal. And it, and it, I thought that been, he was the one that they shoved the night, nightstick up his ass in Brooklyn. Who was that? Okay. Yeah, that was the Admiral. Okay, I get the Spanish, the Spanish victims confused. They did my ignorance. But anyway, this is a real, you know who painted it? No, I don't know who painted it. One of the artists in the neighborhood painted did it. Did he live there? Yes, he did. He did. This, and, he, and, the Loima lived there in this neighborhood in the Bronx. Wheeler Street. What street? Wheeler and Westchester. Wheeler and Westchester yeah. Street. And so this is part of the history and the city, living city of New York City. And this is what we need more of. So young people probably see this and say, who is that? And their parents tell them about how the cops brutalized this man and shot him 50 times. He was just reaching for his wallet, and one cop thought they saw something, a flash of a gun. So they all opened fire. So everyone said they shot him 50 times. But when you're on a team of cops, the first shot fired, everyone opens fire. So it wasn't like they shot this man bang, bang, you know, 50 times in a row. It was just the whole team, once they hear a shot, they know their lives are at risk, and they just, they just mow the guy down. You know the worst part of the story? No, what's the worst part of the story? They had sent the trial upstate in Albany. Right. They were gonna, uh, they wanted charges against the officers. Right. They all got off. They didn't even get negligent homicide. Really? They no. all got and off. And they probably didn't even get demoted yes. or held back no. in their careers. That's what's disgusting. That's an injustice. And do you know that if cops do something, say assault you, and you get a million dollar a, a claim against the city, it doesn't affect the cop's career. The city pays a million dollar claim for the malfeasance of the cop, and the cop, the cop get, doesn't stop getting paid raises with luck, maybe he'll be held back a little bit, maybe rarely demoted or almost never fired, because he's working for the city, and therefore they are invincible. Yeah, so let's yeah. go home.